A Lee Summit lab that helped lead the way for coronavirus testing now offering a new test to look for antibodies. Photo on Action's reporter Ariel Rothfield explains. Inside the Slee Summit lab, viral core teams are processing as many antibody tests as they can to help determine who might have been exposed to the coronavirus. Because it's a really important part of managing the pandemic. Antibodies are proteins the body makes to attack a virus. If someone has a certain antibody, it could mean they either had a vaccine or were infected in the past with the virus, whether they knew it or not. We would ultimately like testing to be available for everybody, just as if you got an influenza test. It takes time for antibodies to develop anywhere from one week to a couple of weeks after initial infection. But since we know that early on in the pandemic, we didn't have enough testing uh, to, to go around, there's no way to know how many people have actually had the virus unless we go back and look for, for a sign that they've had it, you know, two months ago or three months ago. So that's what antibody testing can do for us. Viracor's antibody test requires blood to be drawn. And doctors say even if it can accurately detect antibodies, it's still unknown whether that means you're protected from future infection. Making sure that if the antibody test is positive, then you really have had the disease. And then if it's negative, that you really haven't. So we just need to make sure that all of these, um, these results that you would get as an individual buying this lab is, is fully accurate. Information that might be able to help determine who can donate plasma and return to work, among other things. It can give us an idea of really what the prevalence of the infection is. Um, and that will just help in managing the pandemic at a very large scale. Reporting in Lee Summit, Ariel Rothfield, 41 Action News.